Yeah, yo, what's up, guys? Mixology, and today I have a guest commentator. His name is Pitt. How's it going, Pitt? What's up, guys? Nothing much. Just hanging out. Uh, and uh, yesterday I had to pick up this game. I just really missed this game a lot. It was one of the best sniper games. Sniper game, and it was probably the best Call of Duty overall. What do you think about that, Pitt? Uh, I think it was the best Call of Duty overall. Uh, you know, not even overall, just period. It was the best. Everything was balanced. You know, they didn't have that choose your own kill streak shit going on nowadays where people just fucking sit in a fucking corner and camp and build their kill streaks. You know, that's no skill. I mean, Call of Duty 4, World at War, you actually had to, you know, fucking get your kills by the gun most of the time. You didn't sit in a fucking corner to get your dogs and gun shit, but what can you do? I mean, they have to change the game somehow to make money. I mean, if you came out with the same type of game, they're not going to make money, and that's that's the story behind Activision and what they do. So, yeah. if you ask me what I think about this game, it was the best, and that's why I still play it. I definitely agree with you on that. I think uh, Modern Warfare 2 really changed the game a lot, don't you think? Modern Warfare 2 was the start of all this shit. You know, I mean, you still had the Infinity Ward engine, which was smooth and hit registry was awesome. But, I mean, yeah, I mean, when you can, the Chopper Gunner and AC-130 and Predator Missile and Harrier Jets and all that stuff that came after World at War is what changed the game and made made people upset, you know. I mean, before Modern Warfare 2, I mean, arguably people didn't play World at War because they loved this game so much, so they stayed. But then when Modern Warfare 2 came out, I mean, that's when people just started getting really angry at the Call of Duty franchise, and you have all these haters. But, I mean, it doesn't matter, because you're going to buy Modern Warfare 3 anyways, just like you bought Black Ops and Modern Warfare 2. I mean, everyone's going to buy the new game, you know, so. Yeah, I already hear there's a lot of people hating on Modern Warfare 3. Why do you think they're hating already? It's because they're upset with Black Ops and Modern Warfare 2, but they're hating, but they're going to buy it. They're going to be standing outside in the fucking cold when it comes out on release. Are you pretty excited for the Modern Warfare? I'm going to buy Warfare? it anyways, yeah. <laughs> I'm yeah. going to buy it for sure. I'm excited. That's why I'm not hating on it, because I know I'm going to buy it, you know, so. Do you believe that this M16 in this game was overpowered? Uh, I don't believe it. It was. <laughs> it, was <laughs> it was the best gun in this game. Yeah. For sure. There was no other gun that matched up to it. I mean, stopping power with this gun, it was just, it's a fucking laser gun, dude. Just I love point it. it and shoot, and they're dead. You could hit them in the fucking big toe if you Ooh, wanted to, they'll die. That guy just hip-fired me. Oh, man. But the sniper, I don't think it was too cheap in this game. What do you think? I think the sniper, the, the way the sniper was, uh, you know, the way the sniper worked in this game was perfect. Yeah. It wasn't It wasn't really cheap, but it wasn't really like, you know, Black Ops, you can't really quick scope. Oh, no. I, I, I don't care what anyone says. It's not a real quick scope. Exactly. You know, quick scopes when you aim, you know, just the main, like, you know, when you're not scoped in and you just scope in and like shoot. Like right here. Yeah. Trying right there. there I mean, in, in Black Ops, I guess you could call it a drag scope. Yeah. But there's no quick scoping in Black Ops, you know. Definitely. But I don't know, man. Just coming back to this game, doesn't it? It's just one of those games you just cannot let go. It's like you're, I don't know how to explain it, man. Well, it's nostalgic for sure. I yes, mean, every time I, every time I pick up this game and I play it, you know, it just brings back, you know, really, really fond memories of how I started playing FPS games. This was the actually, actually the first FPS game I ever picked up. You know, a lot of people played Counter-Strike and, uh, Halo 2 and Halo 1 and stuff like that. This was the first game I played, and uh, I pick it up like I pick it up now, and it's just I, I still I love it, you know. I yeah, that's one of the main reasons why I had to pick it up. And uh, what is this all? What is all this thing? What is all this YouTube stuff over here? They're trying to promote all that. Um, all that. What is that? It looks like a AOL web chat to me. What is that, man? Uh, to be honest, I think it's just you know Infinity Ward. Probably you know they stopped maintaining this game. They stopped yeah. you know cleaning up all the glitches and. This has probably been around for a while. I mean, I haven't played the game in a long time. I've been <laughs> yeah. playing Modern Warfare 2 and Black Ops, to be honest. But I think it's just Infinity War is just... They just got... I mean, they stopped fixing Modern Warfare 2, so for sure they're going to stop fixing Call of Duty 4. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, a lot of people didn't know I was really a sniper in COD 4, but if, if you compare my style to Black Ops, what would you say my style was like in COD 4 compared uh, to mean, Black Ops now? I think your style in COD 4 was more... I mean, I don't know. I mean, if like, from this gameplay, I see that you know you, you're kind of playing really, uh, really aggressive but smart at the same time. I mean, same way as in Black Ops, because yeah. I, I play with you, play with you all the time on Black Ops. But uh, I mean, with this in, in Call of Duty Four, most of the time you're getting the kills from the gun, like I said earlier. Yeah. You know, most of your kills are from the gun. 
So, so people don't really camp, huh? I mean, there'll be campers, but it's not it's not as rewarding to camp in this game because sure you're not building a big kill streak. You know, the best kill streak you can get in here is 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 the attack helicopter, and it's not some it's not a kill streak that's going to get you 25 kills. You know. Yeah, that's very true. It's 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 a kill streak that you earn, and it it, it it kills for you pretty much. You don't kill no you kill, no longer kill with a gun. You know, it just kills for you. Yeah. But you know, classic with the, with the chopper gunner and gunship and stuff like that. It, it's, I mean, you can you can. Yeah, you can see with Juggernaut, it doesn't matter, you know, because if you have stopping power, you're gonna drop that dude, right? If you have the first shot on him. Oh, definitely, definitely. You know, and he's not going to kill you as fast because... I mean, that's what balanced the game is. Exactly. People could complain about Juggernaut, but you could also complain about stopping power because you're like, you're wondering, like, why the hell am I dropping so fast? So you stop <laughs> on Juggernaut and it balances everything out. Yeah. So I'd like to see those two come back in uh, Modern yeah. Warfare 3. Yeah, I find it quite annoying with all that stuff in the side, though. That little YouTube.com thing. Oh, yeah, definitely. Definitely yeah, has a couple of extra shit <laughs> on the screen, but... But overall, it's still a fun game. But overall, it doesn't change it. the gameplay. It's just it's just bothersome, I guess. Yes, it is. And this is a pretty cool game. I, I just pretty much came into this game. You wanted me to play this game. Because we used to play a lot. Remember back in the days, we, were, we actually both came from PS3. Oh, yeah, we did. Yeah. It, and was, we, it was fun yeah. on PS3 as well. But Yeah, but... Yeah, hopefully Modern Warfare 3 is really good, and I really just want to put up some COD4 gameplay for you guys, so hope you guys like this game, and uh, tell me what you guys think on the thoughts of what, you know, Pitt had to say, because a lot of it, in my opinion, it had a lot, it was all realistic, so. And may I add, I mean, if you guys have never played Call of Duty 4, and you probably started off at, you know, Black Ops or Modern Warfare 2, I mean, pick up pick up COD 4, dude, and and you, you'll yeah. see, you'll see where the franchise started i mean it's, yeah. i mean it, i arguably it started at call of duty one but pick up cod four and, and then you'll you'll kind of understand why you kind of see game. what yeah. what started everything and yeah you'll get a better so. understanding of the franchise all right guys thanks for uh stopping by pit really oh no problem really, all right man all right guys